What's going on, buddy? My name's Chris. I smell popcorn. And welcome back to some other Let's Play SpongeBob SquarePants Revenge of the Fly Dutchman. Oh boy, oh boy. Okay, Mr. Krabs, right over here. Let's go talk to him with his tongue sticking out. Some of the other workers might try to take the food from you. Order up! Uh oh, the two workers here. What does that even mean, man? Um. Okay. So. Really? I just walked into it last time and automatically picked it up. This time it's not, though. Deliver food to the construction foreman. Well, let's explore here. So I see there's some freaking leg there as well. <gasps> this guy. Oh god! Okay, well, freaking Blue Larry over here. Ruining my day. Can we not kill him? How can we kill him? We can do that. I know we can. Oh, his jackhammer disappeared too. What was even jackhammering, man? Oh, don't touch the cement. That's probably very bad for you. Alright, so yeah, if you drop it, it automatically deletes it from the game, apparently. I don't know. So, seeing as I just played this game not too long ago, of course I know where they are. One's over this way. Tell the food to go Foreman. Ha ha! Actually, pretty close to each other, to be honest. It's really weird. There's one guy here. It's weird. It's like, how would you even know? Deliver complete. You got a tip. Ten doll hairs. It's really weird. He just has a mouth and he has a pipe. Another thing they probably wouldn't be able to get away with today. Let's explore this over here as well. Cha-ching! Cha-ching! Cha-chingles! One, two, three! Ha! Huh. So... I'm pretty sure once you get over here, kind of... Oh, never mind. I thought these didn't come back. Oh, God. Well, I'm screwed anyways. Second death of the game. Well, two deaths in five episodes. That's not bad at all. See, I automatically picked it up for me that time. It's weird. Deliver food to the other form. Okay, hey, there's Patrick! Hey, Patrick. I'll, uh... What are you wearing? I'll, I'll come talk to you in a second, buddy. You look very creepy, I'll have you know. So, if we go over here. All these drills around me going in and out, and they're huge, and they're very scary. Oh, more leg. Delivery complete. You got a tip. Get the next letter from Mr. Curbs. Eh. <laughs> there you go. Yeah, so this area is actually pretty small and pretty easy to get around. I think that's pretty much it. Let's go see what Patrick has to say. Hello, Patrick. Oh, villain. Don't try to get away. For I am Barnacle Boy, Super Sidekick. Where did you get that great costume? I mailed in 450 kelp bar wrappers and got both <laughs> official costumes from the Mermaid Man show. Oh, you got both costumes? Oh, can I be Mermaid Man? Oh, please, oh, please, oh, please. Oh, gee, I'd really like to, but I've been so hungry since I ran out of kelp bars. If only I had something yummy to eat. That's disgusting. He's eating chocolate bars. Now he wants... Now he's, he's hungry. No kidding, you're hungry. You're probably extremely sick as well, Patrick. There's nothing but can't... Well, I guess like kelp is probably healthy, right? So maybe they weren't candy. Maybe they're like breakfast bars. Are those unhealthy for you? I don't know. Move something heavy onto the pressure plates. I want to talk about this because I had an issue with this. But we'll get back to that in a second once I catch all the jellyfish. Blue ones maybe run away from you. Hmm. So will the gold the gold ones maybe chase after you? What the heck would that mean for the red ones then? Are they just fast or something? So yeah, this pressure plate. I thought how do we throw this out actually? Can we didn't even do that? No, it's too heavy. Okay, it's impossible. See, when it says put something heavy on the pressure plate, and considering how huge it is, what I thought you had to do... Where is it? It's a wrecking ball. That wrecking ball right there. I thought for sure we had to get up there and somehow break that string and hit it in such a way that it lands on top of the pressure plate. I mean, that makes sense, right? But no, what, all you gotta do is take these rocks and throw them. It took forever for me to figure out that, no, you just put these rocks and for some reason... These rocks are, like, they look like they don't weigh very much, but they actually weigh thousands of pounds, apparently. And SpongeBob can lift them, no problem. Go, yes. And it lifts these platforms. It's great. It's brilliant. I don't get it. it makes no sense. It's stupid. It's so stupid. I'm very bitter about it, as you can tell. That was one more. Okay, I was going to say, I thought that was the last one. I hate everything. Stupid. And, uh, yeah, that's all you do. <laughs> 
I need to climb up here. Oh, not touch a giant wrecking ball. Oh, I touched a giant wrecking ball. I came in like a wrecking ball. Dang it. Don't you hate it when you came in like a wrecking ball? Get it? It's a Miley Cyrus reference. That's a, I always have to think for a second. Like, wait, is her name Miley Cyrus or Hannah Montana? Like, no, it's Miley Cyrus. You stupid. Yay, and there's a letter up there. So many doubloons. I can't wait to sink my teeth into. Oh, there's so much cement. That should have killed me. This delivery won't be easy at all. Three different parties called from the high rise apartments. Oh, I forgot all this too. The high rise apartments. And if you notice, you have some food here. Why don't we throw it on the ground? This is just, oh, it just reappears here. Interesting. Very strange as well. Okay, deliver food to Patrick. This Mr. Krabs is perfectly content with leaving food, just laying around. Wow, that was very glitchy. Hello, Patrick. No, 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 no. He just ate the bag and all. Jeez, man. Watch out, evil. Here we come. Watch out, evil. Here we come. La, 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 la. All right, Mermaid Man, are you guys ready? For the most pointless costume in this game? Press B to throw a water ball. The water walls are damaged, distant targets. Bam. So I'm pretty sure this costume is used like twice in this game. It's really dumb. Um, I don't know why. It's like you'd think this would be really good to utilize. And also, I was surprised I was able to figure this out as quickly as I did. But uh, if you actually come up here and shoot a water ball at this red blink thing that I totally just thought was a light. I was like, eh, let's try it out. And I was able to figure it out. Like, it's pretty hard to hit, right? No, it's a red hot bolt. Red hot bolt. That weird. And it causes things to fall and stuff to break and things to destroy. So, yeah, thankfully, it at least hits you and burn you to death because that'd be very terrifying. Oh, I almost fell down. Yeah. What did that do? There's money up there. Does that just lead to money, really? Or is it more than just money? Yeah, I guess, like, you, you can't have the purpose of using it to kill enemies. But it's like, why? Whoa, geez, this guy takes freaking three hits still. I figured with a water ball, it'd be more strong. So powerful. Much more powerful. Oh, he's dead. I killed him till he was deaded. No! Damn it. I need to go back. Whoa. Wow, I, I'm actually pretty sad at myself for not collecting these the first time. Um, did I miss anything else here? Can we go up here now? I'm curious. No, it doesn't look like. Nah, well, no, you definitely can't make it up. Okay. Uh, ooh, oh. Do, 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 do. Cause like honestly, this suit would be good to wear if it wasn't for the fishing costume that you need for like most of the game, right? So it's like, why would you wear this ever? <laughs> I mean, it's a good default costume if you could automatically, like, if you automatically had the fishing net on you, it wouldn't be too big of a deal, because I'd be like, yeah, this is cool. But no, it's like, you need the fishing gear, so, you can, like, now we're just back to this song. The song really wears on your ears after you realize, or once you, like, switch costumes and switch back, and like, oh yeah, this costume. Oops. I did not do a power jump successfully. A power jump. <laughs> That's kind of a dumb name. I guess it's better than a super jump, really, but still. Also, this toy looks like a penis. Just just wanted to point that out to you. Oh, camera. Alright, so hopefully you can float to this money. Nope. That's how we get it. We gotta do it. Oh, no! Third death, five episodes. Dang it. Oh, it's okay. At least we'll squeak our way to victory. Squeak, 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 squeak. We do need that money, though, since it is a part of my 100% dealio. No! Come back, Mr. Jellington Fish! Come back! Yay! Alright, let's go try that again. Uno more times. Because this time I'm totally going to get it, I would hope. Like, there's... Pretty sure there's no other, like... You don't get anything else from using the other... But, like, the Mermaid Man suit. You don't get, like, a longer jumping distance. Like, you know, he's a superhero. You'd think, hey, I can fly! Not really. The only special thing is you get water balls. Yep. 
pretty silly in my opinion. Right. Let me just do this dead on here. Right. Good thing about squatting is you can aim yourself pretty well. Alright. Big money, big money. No. Do we maybe you do get a slight jump boost? Cause I don't remember this being this hard. Oh you know, I bet you do it from here. Oh, that'd be kind of weird. No, damn it! Ah, this is where death procession comes an issue for me. In areas like this, so far it's looking like I'm cleaning one area per episode, which means, um, well, there's seven levels. And, well, you know, let's not do math here. I don't know how many areas in total. Each level has three areas, though, besides Bikini Bottom. Just has the two. Now let's count the Krusty Krab. I guess if we do count the Krusty Krab, that counts as three. All right, let's try from here. And yeah, there we go. Twenty-six. What is this crap? Did I just give me one? Did I give me like eleven or something? Krabby dollars, <laughs> sand dollars. Krabby dollars. What is this? Aha, there's a jellyfish over here. I knew it. Thought I saw something. Alright. Um. Yeah, because, yeah, we're definitely completing the construction zone in this episode. And then, after that, we'll do the high rise, which will probably also take another episode. And we'll pretty much be down, be done, downtown Bikini Bottom. And we can move on to one of my favorite levels Sandy Tree Dome. There's a lot of levels I like. Um. One I probably dislike the most actually probably is. Bikini, but is it? Oh, dang it. The rest of them are pretty cool. I, I really like the majority of the levels in this game. The only thing is, like, Bikini Bottom's really vacant. I mean, this, like, every, everywhere's pretty vacant, to be honest, but at least, like, here, there's a lot of, like, stuff going on, you know? The construction zone and all that, and dang it. There's a lot of moving parts instead of just not moving parts. <laughs> Alright, let's see if we can make this jump. Doesn't help that you don't have a machado. Uh, a shadow. <laughs> you don't have a shadow on a lot of moving objects. Dang it! So it makes it hard sometimes to figure out where you are in relation when you're jumping to something. All right, let's get these. So jump down here. Uh oh. Uh oh. Fine. It's fine. fine. Everything's fine. Also, now the camera's gonna make this very this jump very difficult. Okay. 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 Uh huh. Oh no, I gotta sneeze. Oh no! Oh no! <sighs> Ooh, snap. That's okay, we were done exploring that area anyways. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Ow. 312, okay, how many? See, it doesn't give you a number of how much stuff you have. Which is kind of annoying. Um, as in like, it tells you the percentage, like, as in, like 60% downtown and 65% downtown, but it doesn't tell you like 35 jellyfish. It just tells you the percentage. And that is a thing I don't like, you guys. Alright. Uh, ooh. Ooh, baby. Ooh. Dang it! Crap, I shot my You can't get up this way, can you? No, you can't. You gotta go around. You gotta bring it around town. Maybe we can get on there from the wrecking ball. <gasps> I came in like a. I'm sorry. Very sorry. Oh, that's gonna hurt me. Hey, it didn't hurt me. Ah, look at that. Look at that. Look at that over there. Okay, here we go. Okay. Actually, we can get to both areas like that, can't we? Oh, maybe not. Oh, I guess we can. Oh, depth perception. Yeah, the fact that there's no shadows on these. I mean, you have a shadow on some objects of the game, but not all of them. So, on the objects you don't, when you're trying to land on them, good lord, good luck with that. Uh, make the job. Ah, oh, why'd that hurt me? Just because I hit the side of it? Is that how hit detection works in this game? Oh, no. She, but meanwhile, I smacked my head into a moving wrecking ball. And it doesn't hurt me then. What the heck, game? What is this? Some kind of stupid game? Oh, god. Oh god, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I was making fun of Mike Matei and it just came to bite me in the bum. 
Bam. Is it? There's more here than that. Ooh. All right. Have a good lookout spot here. Yeah, I guess that's it in this area. So, what did we get here? We got a mermaid man suit. And that's really it. Oh, let's go to high rise. You guys saw there was actually an entrance as well at the uh, in the downtown portion. We're gonna enter it through the business district or the the um the construction zone. Here we go. High rise where all the cool kids live, or something. I don't know. Oh, I don't know. Mermaid Man and Barnacle Boy. So yeah, the only other time you see Mermaid Man is like I believe like the second last level in the game. Apartment nine. I wrote down the other two addresses for you. Make sure to visit both buildings. Good luck. Fine. But we'll do this in the next episode. So thank you guys so much for watching this episode. If you enjoyed, we're at 63%, 65, and 12%. Wow, we don't have any monies. Top of the high rise, check the high rise plumbing, complete all food deliveries, help Sandy clean up the trash. To help Sandy clean up the trash when we actually can't even do it. Three, <gasps> three, three, three doubloons. We are partially Satan. Wow. Look at that giant jellyfish, too. What does that guy do? And how will we even navigate this area? I don't know. I guess you guys will have to wait and see. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys enjoyed my episode, the best way to support me is by leaving a like on the video and subscribing to my channel. If there's any recommendations you have for games to play, check out the top link in my description. And, uh, yeah, I'll talk to you guys later. Bye!